Hello, we have three pairs of questions here. The first pair will tell me question A, and the second pair question B, and the third pair question C. Now, we are going to do a very simple exercise with this pair of questions. Like in question A, we have one which says, which one is more beautiful? And question two that says, which is more beautiful? And here is the exercise. What is the difference between this which and this which as used in these questions? Let's go to B. Under B, we have question one that says, what time does the meeting start? And question two, which says, what is the time that the meeting starts? What is the difference between this what and this what? And then similarly, under question C, we have one, whose is this car? And two, whose car is this? What is the difference between this whose and this whose? Now let's start with question A. Now, these two are questions quite all right. This which and this which, they are interrogative words. Interrogative words are words used to ask questions. So both of them are interrogative words, okay? But if you look at this which in question one, you can notice that it modifies a noun, which is one. One here is a noun. So which modifies a noun. And being a modifier, it is an adjective. So that this which can best be described as an interrogative adjective. Do you understand? Which one is more beautiful? Now coming to question two. This which does not describe any noun. Rather, it stands in place of a noun. We have that which is more beautiful. So which, standing in place of a noun, is a pronoun and can best be described as an interrogative word pronoun. So why this which is an interrogative adjective, this one is an interrogative word pronoun. Now let's go to question B. The first one says, what time does the meeting start? Of course, both are interrogative words. But if you look at this word, it modifies the noun, time. And being a modifier, it is an adjective. So what here is an interrogative adjective. And then number two says, what is the time that the meeting starts? What here stands in place of a noun. It is not modifying any noun. So what here? is a pronoun and can best be described as an interrogative pronoun. So, even though both of them are what, what, whereas this is an interrogative adjective, why this is an interrogative word pronoun. Now, let's go to the last one, question C. Whose is this car? Now, look at this whose. Both of them, of course, are interrogative words. But this whose stands in place of a noun. It is not modifying any noun. So it is a pronoun and is best described as an interrogative pronoun. Okay. Now, number two says, whose car is this? As you can see, whose here modifies the noun car, which makes whose an adjective and is best described as an interrogative pronoun adjective please note that whose here beside being interrogative words are also possessive words in which case the whose in number one is a possessive pronoun while the whose in number two is a possessive adjective all right now here is your exercise you are to choose any one of which what and whose whichever you choose use it to make two sentences one where it functions as an interrogative adjective and the other where it functions as an interrogative pronoun. Leave your answer in the comment section. Thank you very much for watching.